Hello to everyone. I am Dr. Alkesh Agarwal and in this lecture I will mainly discuss about five variable K-maps with don't care conditions. Here are some reference books that include book Digital Design authored by M. Morris Mano and M. D. Saleti and their book is Modern Digital Electronics authored by R. P. Jen. We know that uh, there are mainly two methods by which we can reduce a Boolean function. So these methods include Kano mapping method and another method is known as Tabler method with another name Quinn McCluskey method. So in this uh, lecture I will mainly focus on five variable K maps with don't care conditions. So before going into the detail, let us first uh, discuss about the structure of a five variable K map. So here you can see we have two different maps. One map is for V0 to 0, another map is for V0 to 1. So this can be explained with the help of this uh, table. In this table, we have five variables V, W, X, Y, Z. Out of these variables, Z is the least significant bit and V is the most significant bit. So if we concentrate on this uh, most significant bit v we can see here that in the entire table the value of v is fixed to zero and since this k map is being plotted for uh, corresponding to the combination of these variables and in this variable v is fixed to zero so therefore we have this k map where for v is equal to zero and this is being kept outside because for all these main terms v is 0 and rest the variables w x y z has different combination similarly if we see this table corresponding to this k map here the variable v which is again most significant bit is fixed to 1 and therefore for this map this map is for v0 to 1 where the value for all these min terms the variable v has value 1 rest the variables w x y z has values varying from all zeros to all ones so for five variable k map we have a map for v0 to 0 another map is for v0 to 1 rest w x y z variables these w x corresponds to row variables and this uh, y z variable corresponds to column variables and these wz variables are in gray codes whereas yz variables are also in gray code so we have 16 main terms in v is equal to 0 map and another 16 main terms in v is equal to 1 map so in v is equal to 0 map we have main terms starting from m0 to m15 and for v is equal to 1 we have main terms from m16 to m31 because in this table the first value is all zeros corresponding to min term m0. The last variable is 0, 1, 1, 1, 1 that corresponds to min term 15. Where in this table we have first combination 1 and 0, 0, 0, 0 that corresponds to min term m16. And the last combination is all 1s that corresponds to min term 31. Now here we see that uh, this whole map v is equal to 1 is being overlapped over v is equal to 0 map so that all these rows are being overlapped by all these rows of v is equal to 1 and all the columns of v is equal to 0 map is being overlapped by v is equal to 1 map so that we mainly focus to have a group that is common to both the maps we'll go 0 is equal to v is equal to 1 so that we have the formation of biggest group out of these two maps so further this uh, concept is being cleared with the help of some examples with don't care conditions so in this very example, we have a Boolean function of five variables, v, w, x, y, z, where we have main terms 0, 2, 5, 7, 10, 13, 16, 23, 24, 26, 29, 31, with don't care condition 8, 15, 18, and 21. So we plotted all these main terms in v is equal to 0 map and v is equal to 1 map with don't care conditions at m8, m15 m18 and m21 so here we we first we'll discuss about uh, 
the don't care condition these don't care condition are being depicted as cross because they can be considered as one or they can be considered as zero so if a don't care condition can be grouped with other main terms so that particular don't care condition is being treated as one otherwise if it cannot be grouped with other main terms in any group then that um, uh, don't care condition is being treated as zero so let us now see the first group uh, which is being formed by these uh, main terms at m0 m2 m10 with a don't care condition m8 so here at four corners of a visual zero map we have three main terms and one don't care condition so if we group this don't care condition with other three cornered main terms so we have a group of four main terms similarly we have three main terms at four three corners with m16 m24 m26 with this don't care condition so again we'll uh, use this don't care condition with other three min terms to make a group of four. So now with the min terms of four from this map and min terms of of a group of in four from this uh, map is equal to one, we have a bigger group of eight min terms which is forming group one. So this now this min term will be treated as uh, this don't care condition will be treated as one and this don't care condition will be treated as one so so we have a group one with eight min terms out of which six are min terms and two are don't care conditions so we can directly write them in reduce form so for that since this group is common to both the maps we go to zero and we go to one so we variable will be eliminated now we'll focus on first row and last row where wx is 0 0 and wx is 1 0 so w is changing and x is fixed to 0 so we have x bar now we'll concentrate on first column and last column where yz is 0 0 and yz is 1 0 so here this y variable is changed and z is fixed to 0 so we have x bar and z bar as in reduced form i'll concentrate on group 2 again you can see in group 2 we have one uh, don't care condition and three main terms again here in uh, map visual one we have one don't care condition and three main terms so we can combine this don't care condition with the other three main terms to form a group of four in visual zero map and this don't care condition at m21 can be grouped with other three main terms to form a group of four so since we have the main terms and overlapping positions so we have a group two of eight main terms from v is equal to 0 map and v is equal to 1 map so now let us write in reduce form so this since this uh, group of 8 min terms in common to both the maps so this uh, variable v is eliminated now i'll concentrate on row 2 and row 3 where w is changed and x is fixed to 1 so we have x if we consider in our second and third column so we have yz variable is changing and z is fixed to 1 so we have exit is reduced form so finally reduced form from both the groups is x bar z bar or xz now let us take another example with don't care condition which is terms of max term so we have pi in terms of max term 4 7 11 15 19 21 23 29 with don't care conditions 3 27 20 31 so we have plotted all the max term so here we see that max terms are being plotted in terms of zeros not ones main terms are plotted in terms of ones whereas max terms are plotted in terms of zero we have four don't care condition plotted at m3 m27 m28 and m31 now we can easily see that in visual zero map we have one don't care condition with three max terms m7 m15 m11 making a group of four and in visual one map we have two max terms and two don't care conditions at m3127 which is making group of four max terms so since these two are uh, in overlapping positions that is here also we have 
the maxims in third column here also we have maxim third column so they will combine to form a group one with the uh, eight maxims so now directly we can write in reduce form since uh, these uh, this group corresponds to all the rows so wx variable will be eliminated and yz is fixed to one one so the reduce form will be y bar or z bar this can directly be written from these two maps i will focus on to group number two where group number two has three max terms with one down k condition making a group of four max term which is confined to v is equal to one map so easily we can write in ps form since v is equal to one so we write v bar then focus on to second and third row where w is changed and x is fixed to one so we'll write x bar we'll concentrate on second and third column where y z is zero one and one one so y is changed and z is fixed so we write z bar so reduce form is v bar or x bar or z bar in ps form so we are writing in ps form because the function is being given in max term I will focus on group 3. It is a combination of 1 don't care condition and 1 maximum. This maximum is combined with this don't care condition to form a group of 2. So, which is again uh, confined to v is equal to 1 map. So, when v is equal to 1, we write v bar and w is 1, x is 1. So, we write w bar or x bar. And here y is fixed and z is changed. So, y is 0. So, we will write y. So reduce form is v bar or w bar or x bar or y this max term is uh, isolated one so we can directly write it in reduce form here v is zero so we write v w is zero x is one so we write w or x bar and y z is zero zero so we write y or z so our reduce form is y bar or z bar and v bar or x bar or z bar or n v bar or w bar or x bar or y and v or w or x bar or y or z so this is in reduced form with an example of five variable came up with don't care conditions thank you